Hi, welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do asymmetric effect panel ARDL model in eViews. Previously, uh, the asymmetric effect model is only available in time series where you can see the asymmetric effect test or charts uh, that can show you how much asymmetric effect is there. In the newer version of eViews, which I'm going to show you, you can estimate panel ARDL model with asymmetric effects. And then you can also check if the asymmetric effect is significantly present in long run and short run. So I will run with an example of panel data of five countries in 1992 to 2020. I will open up as an equation. So the variables are already selected. I will go in panel ARDL. I will, first of all, I will do, I will remove one of the variable. I will open up it again. I will remove one of the variable and move it towards uh, asymmetric effect. So I will move LBM, put it here as a asymmetric effect in both long run and short run. And then I will try to make sure the legs are as few as possible so that there is no multicollinearity. So I will select two legs here and I will run this model. So you can see in this model there are asymmetric effect of cumulative uh, uh, positive and, 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 and then negative. So you can see both variables are there and they are also present in the short run. So now this is the first difference that you can uh, see in this EVUs. So you can see this code. It means if you learn this code, I will show you later on, you can you can create a, a asymmetric effect variable in any other model. So like this, if I minimize it and, and name it. Okay, and I open up this model as like if I open up as an equation and I wanted to do quantile regression, so I will do a quantile regression here and, and then first of all I will run it, move this one here and then I will go back and change this variable to at the rate CUMDP and LBM at the rate CUMDP DN at LBM. So when you run it, this function is not working uh, because the brackets are not correctly added. So so you can make sure that brackets are correctly added so that you can run this model. Uh, further, you can see it here that and then you can have it, the short run is D for first difference and this model is here. And now you want to see if you can check for symmetry. You can get for symmetry here so it shows that they are significantly different so there is asymmetric effect then you can see country wise so first country there is no asymmetry in the short run second country there is asymmetry in the short run third country no asymmetry fourth country no asymmetry fifth country no asymmetry so there is only one country where there is asymmetric effect then further in this ARDL model you can also go for bound test so you can see the bound test here only only first country is significant at 10 percent and there's contiguation there while others do not have if for the mixed order of variables so and then if you want to see the other other estimates for pmg you can open up here and then see if the the long run coefficient are different in, in other models so you can see that the long run coefficient of mg and pmg the asymmetric variables are same and for uh, the DFE has not been estimated because it, it only estimates if uh, if you have uh, you do not uh, if it is estimatable for the given data thank you very much for watching